Today, a former Brevard County teacher who was fired for using prescribed medical marijuana met virtually with Florida's Agriculture Commissioner. Commissioner Nikki Freed says state policy surrounding medical marijuana need to be modernized. And as Channel 9's Karen Parks reports, that teacher desperately wants her job back. I take a pill in the morning and a pill at night. Today, Commissioner of Agriculture and Consumer Services Nikki Freed listened to a former Brevard County teacher fired for using medical marijuana. I've spent over 30 five years building my professional integrity and so this is uh, really kind of a uh, a blow. Allison Enright was prescribed medical marijuana as part of her treatment after being physically abused by a student. Within a week I was on administrative leave and I have now been terminated due to uh, breaking the drug-free policy. A spokesperson for the Brevard County Public Schools released this statement. Any employee who tests positive to a controlled substance as defined in our drug-free workplace policy is subject to disciplinary action up to and including termination. And what teachers sign at the beginning of the year says that they're not going to use illegal drugs and they're not going to abuse legal ones. Um, Ms. Enright did didn't do either. Commissioner Freed says more than 500,000 Floridians are on the medical marijuana registry. And we can't, uh, you know, attract and retain, you know, world-class workforce without medical marijuana employment protection. She says those protections need to start at the federal level and then states like Florida need to jump on board. We have been supporting uh, bills both in the House and the Senate that create employee protections uh, and unfortunately uh, neither bills in either chamber has moved. In the meantime, Allison Enright has exhausted all of her appeals in the fight to get her job back but still hopes that one day she'll be back in the classroom. Karen Parks, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.